Anybody here? Hey, excuse me. You need something? Uh, I heard you could fix bats. Do you, uh, work here? Yep. I'm Sumire Sawa. I run this place, if you can believe that. You're the manager? What? Having second thoughts because the manager's a girl? No, not really. So, this what you want fixed? This bat? Looks to me like it's been sitting around for a while. It's pretty rusty, too. Yeah, it's something I picked up. Still, it's special to me. <gasps> Hold on. This bat. Is this from the Hero series? Huh? The hell's that? It's a really, really rare bat that was only in production for a limited time thanks to the manufacturer going bankrupt. I can't believe I've seen one with my own eyes. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Please let me fix it. Just this once. I promise I'll make it special. I'll even do it for free. Whoa, really? Yeah. Fixing up something as rare as this would be a dream come true. I'd be honored. <laughs> hey, thanks. Great. I'll get to work right away. <laughs> Holy shit, let's do this! Oh. about Phew. that's some energy you got I used to be a bit of a punk so I tend to get pretty riled up about stuff anyway here thanks for waiting yo that thing looks like it's brand new <laughs> and that's not all to make sure it won't get all dinged up in the future, I added a special coating. That little beauty should be harder and more durable than ever. Thanks. I'll put it to good use. You sure are talented, you know that? <laughs> well, I definitely know how to fix things. Management's a different story, though. Yeah, now that you mention it, this place is pretty empty. I'm guessing you haven't been getting much business. Much? Try none at all. Nowadays, it's normal to toss clothes and things out if they're ripped or broken or whatever. People don't really get things fixed anymore. And as much as my dad tried to keep this place going, he wasn't very good at it. He wasn't good with money and got in a lot of debt. Had to sell most of our machinery to pay it off. So, pretty much all that's left is the stuff no one would buy. That limited what jobs we could take, and as a result, we kept losing more and more business. That's rough. But I really love this job. I love being here. My granddad who opened this place was a really skilled technician. He's been a constant inspiration to me, even long after he passed away. This place is all I have left of him, and I don't want to lose it. My dad may have thrown in the towel, but that doesn't mean I can't keep trying. I think I might be at my limit, though. I guess we're just in a time where we're not needed anymore. Me or this shop. Yeah, well, I don't know about all that. But look at it this way. You've been doing the best you possibly can. And maybe you're at rock bottom right now, but that doesn't mean you won't make it out eventually, right? Huh? I mean, maybe it ain't all that convincing coming from a guy who just barely got out of being homeless. But at the very least, I plan to keep coming back here to have you work on shit for me. Don't forget that, all right? <laughs> You've got a lot of spirit. Don't see that too much anymore. What's your name? Ichiban Kasuga. All right, Kasuga-san. If you really mean that, then you're welcome anytime. Whether it's a bat or something else, I'll make it better than new. But this time's the only free one, okay? Yeah, sure. I'll be counting on you, Sumi Rachan.
Got it. 